Time to go to work. Alright guys, so this is called Deep Rock Galactic. It's a very fun game. I just want to kind of do like a preview type uh, introduction to this game. I'm not going to show you guys the whole playthrough. It's just not, not what I want to do. But you're you're on a ship. Now originally you start and you do um, an intro, which is like a tutorial. But once you get in here, you have four bays in here where you have... It's four total dwarves. So let me show them to you guys. So you have four right now. I am um, on the driller. There's also an engineer. So the driller has a set of, you can see on the right there, a set of uh, like drill bits to drill through stuff. The engineer can do these like uh, platforms it can shoot out. And it also has a gun. You can see it's putting up a, like a turret. The gunner has a zip line that you can use and also has some pretty cool grenades and then the scout has like a grapple. So what this game is basically based off of is like a four player game. You can play solo and I'll show you guys how this works. So this is on the ship inside the terminal. Here's the mission terminal. So when you grab a mission terminal, you're going to pick one of these missions and when you pick a mission and like if I click this one, this is a simple mining mission. You have join. You can join other people. You can host a public. You can host with friends. Or you can play solo. So we're going to skip out of here. I'm not going to do that. But when you hit the server list, I'll show you guys. I can hit the server list. And I can find other players who have their games listed um, as public. And in here you can see, you know, who's in the game right now. A driller and a scout. So if I want to join this one, I could join it. It's 36 seconds into it and it's an on-site refining one so, so let's go ahead and get out of here now on the ship i want to kind of show you guys around um here's where you fix your pickaxes you can upgrade your pick here's where you can upgrade your equipment like your what weapon you're using your handgun your you can put different stuff on your pick like you can upgrade it a little bit so these are upgrades for everything there's his uh power drills i was telling you about and then there's a satchel charge and then he's also got a grenade and then there's his armor so that's how you do it you also have some perks you can put in here so the perks will give you different things like right now you can just read that if you want to pause it but that's what i have on there and then i have the heightened senses and then i have the beast master so i can tame a beast while i'm running around here's your drone place where you have a drone if you're playing solo mode you have a drone that follows you around it looks like this um, what it originally looks like is like that and then it'll follow you around and it'll harvest minerals for you and everything once you get to level i think it's 10 or 14 or something like that you can access the assignment board assignments give you different things that will give you different perks um completion rewards it'll tell you what they are so you can just click on them and see what they are each one has different things and over here is the shop where you can buy different upgrades um, use your points you get from harvesting stuff up here and then you can get these different things like I can get different hats you can look at this change in his head I can change his eyebrows can't really see those that much you can change his beard if you want to get different beards so anything you want to buy different armor different hats headwear armor is different right now I have one armor I haven't bought yet I like the one I have on but then there's another one here it shows you what it looks like but you can't buy it yet you can also buy some of these as DLCs and then you have an um this is called the rival what incursions so as you do these you get different points and you can go into the trees so as you get them you come into a cosmetic tree and you can buy different items in here different colors of skins different uh, poses you do different headgear that kind of stuff as you complete more stuff you can get into the forge you get a little further along you can activate the forge where you can actually upgrade what we call over the overclocks most of you guys know what overclocks are and then you have the deep dives and the deep dives are a little different and you get to a certain level once you get a promotion um i had to get to level 25 to get this guy a promotion 25 of these um and then once you get the promotion you can do these deep dives. deep dives are three part missions so you can either join one or you can launch one but once you get into them you have to do three so you can do a solo, you can do private, you can do public. But once you do them, you have to do all three missions or you won't complete it and you won't get the items from it, okay? So over here, that little thing going up and down, that goes to the Hall of uh, Heroes. There's another way into it that way, but we won't show you that. There's also a bar over here where you can buy drinks that are pretty much pointless, right? There's also a place over here where you can kick these barrels and you try to kick them through that hoop. Um, I slipped! 
And as you kick them through that hoop, you get points, and you see that, and you get a tally of how good you do. So it's pretty easy to do once you get the hang. You just kind of aim as a jukebox in here. But that's kind of the gist of the, the area you're playing in. There's also a wardrobe place in here where you can come in here and you can change your outfits. You can change your hair. You can do these different helmets or whatever you've gained. It's pretty cool. And then you have different skins. Like I just bought this blue one, so I like this one with the purple hair. And um, as you go, guys, I'll show you a little complete mission. I'll show you a little bit of gameplay. But basically what you're doing is you're harvesting metals. Let's look at this. There's, um, there's several assignments that you can do, but the missions run in different ways. There's a mining expedition, which is the first one you get into where you're just mining uh, more kite. And you're also getting other things that you deposit them into the mule. And then once you leave, you call the drop pod and you got to get out of there and follow them. Okay, the second mission is an egg hunt where you're trying to collect these eggs, these bug eggs, and you put them in the mule as well and you harvest them, get out of there. The third one's the on site refining mission where you have a big uh, kind of extractor. It's uh, where you got to find these three wells. You got to connect the extractor to it with pipes and you got to defend the pipes from these bugs that are attacking you. And then the fourth one is the salvage mission. So these four are the four you get pretty quick on. So the salvage mission, you got to find a rescue three of the mules or two of the mules and then three later on. Um, you reattach their legs. You head to the drop pod. You basically upload, uplink the drop pod, and then you got to refuel the drop pod and defend it. And then eventually they'll let you leave. As you get further along, you get past these four. You can get what's called a point extraction point extraction you're looking for these little dots in the walls and you're going to harvest these things and then you're going to once you collect so many that they want you to you can get out of there you can also have a secondary objections to each one of these you collect other stuff then you have an escort duty which is the dozer dozer this one's pretty cool they drop down a dozer you follow the dozer it harvests this thing right here and once it's done harvesting you extract it and you get out of there then you have an elimination one the elimination one is where you got to find these two pods that look like this there's two of them one of them's one giant beast and one of them's two beasts and you got to fight those guys when you finish fighting them you get the heck out of there and then there's the industrial sabotage and i haven't done this one yet this is a new one i just got last night so i haven't done it yet so i can't really tell you about it but you locate power stations you call in a hacking pod you connect the nodes you defend the hacking pod you lower the vault shields and then you secure the data rack and you get the heck out of there that's pretty much it guys so that's the missions there might be a couple of other ones down the road later i don't know for sure i just know the ones you have um and you have a pretty good guide in here the tutorial is pretty good but that's the game guys i'll show you a few minutes of playthrough but i hope you guys enjoy it it is a very fun game to play with other four people for the most part people don't talk they just kind of show each other what's Walk going on talk to each other like that like i just did but uh, so you can set up the multiplayer to play with vocals, but I think that's just rude because people are mean. So when you do them up, like if I want to set up one, I could set it up and I could go in here and I could go host public. And I think there's somewhere in here. I can't figure out where in here, but it's got to be in the settings. So you got to be able to do it in your settings in here where you can change the options and you can pick... Um, if you can do that in privacy or not or whatever if people can talk to you or not um anyway i'm not gonna read all that but you guys can look in here it's pretty easy to find this stuff the controls and the audio and everything's in here so you can pretty much see if you want push the talk you can turn that off and you can you, you can actually hide when you're doing multiplayer whether people can hear you or not but that's the that's the guys it that's it let me show you guys about two minutes of playthrough i'll show you the bugs i'll show you some of the minerals and if you guys like the video please like and subscribe this is a very fun game though solo mode or with other players um so thanks for watching guys and i'll see you next time get behind something Go, Bosco! Help me with the minerals here! Oh, 
contact! Four, uh, wait, six, no, uh, twelve! A lot of aliens heading your way. Swarm! It's a big one, team! Met. That was some first class mining team. Escape button on the mule is activated. Supply pod launched. Better stand back. Wave is almost over. 